Here is the clock that I'm going to um, upscale today. Um, I am going to change it to a gray color. So I am taping up the clock face with painter's tape all the way around. As you can see, I started doing it so that I can get the gold trim because I'm going to leave it gold. But just change the wood. I'm going to spray paint the wood. So this is what it looks like. I'm going to show you that it's all been taped up. And here is the painter's tape um, all around the base of the clock so that I can then paint the wood without getting paint on that part. Okay, so here it is. Um, all the glass in the face of the clock has been taped up um, and I have it ready so that I can, sp I can spray paint it. <clears throat> not the best job of being covered but it doesn't matter as long as it is covered <clears throat> this tape is very forgiven and will come off easily and I believe that this is will that this will work this is the first coat of paint and the covering has done really well I'm gonna do another coat and then I'll tell you what I'm going to do after. So far, this is what the clock looks like after I've taken the masking tape off, or the painter's tape. And I am loving the way the color came out. You can see the wood grain, but it isn't um, shiny, which I'm glad. But the only thing I don't like, and I don't know if you can see it, is see right inside with a pellinger is going to be with a little it's that color of the wood that brown color so I'm gonna have to take it apart and paint that inside there white which is fine because um, it's still gonna look great once I have that all put together so that's what it looks like after I've undone the masking that um, I unscrewed the back just had four screws no biggie um, and it was wood so I just took that pot out and I sprayed it in gray like the rest of the of the clock and I'm gonna turn it the other way screw it back in put it together with this which I cannot pronounce so I'm not gonna try and butch it again and I'll show you what it looks like and all there together. it is, back on the wall, painted in a slate gray that I like, and I am extremely happy with the way it came out. Hope someone tries it. What do you have to lose? All you gotta do is change the color. Let me know if you do. I would love to see your creations. Thanks.